Tapper Cox is a multi-award winning artist who is currently starting as Glinda the Good Witch in the revival of The Wiz. Well, she also has another project that is near and dear to her. It is her rosé. It mm -hmm. is named after her three children and Deborah joins us now with more. Good Hi. morning. Good morning. Thank you for getting up with us because I know you yes. have a couple of shows coming up this afternoon. I do, But of yes. course we're starting with a little wine. Kazaisu? Yes, Kazaisu. A little holiday rosé. Holiday yes. rosé. Yes, this is my latest project, my fourth baby, Ooh. I like to say. Okay, okay. <laughs> yeah. How did this all come about? Well, I've been a lover of wine for a very long time. I used to sing backgrounds for Celine Dion, mm. and when we'd have our days off, I would go to the different wine tastings and just sort of explore. Uh, little did I know, I had a little bit of a palate. Oh. Mm -hmm. And um, it's... Um, Part of sort of my, my, one of the drinks that I go to after a show or something, it's light on my vocal cords, mm -hmm. but I wanted something orga organic and I was, I couldn't really find something that was, had the notes that I like, like this has Grenache and Cezol. Um and so it's, it's, it's perfect for me and I figured it would be lovely for, for others as well. You can't only drink rosé during the summer. You no. can drink it rosé all, all day. day. How did you come up with the, with the, the notes and the exact flavor palette you wanted? Because I imagine that's got to be very extensive given what's out yeah. there, right? Yeah. It, it took a while to really develop something that was really to my liking. I like a dry rosé. I don't like Me anything too. too sweet. Mm -hmm. So this was like the perfect combination. And I really wanted to make sure that we focused on something that was sustainable like I said, organic. I went to uh, the vineyard in Provence. Uh, Chateau Magliere is the, is wow. the, uh, the vineyard um, that we went. Um, and, you know, we were pretty extensive in the process, mm -hmm. learning the process of winemaking. So it's something that I'm really um, proud of, and, and it tastes delicious. It's, it's fantastic. fantastic. How long did it take for you to come up with this? How long was the process? I would that? say a um, two-year process. Okay. A two-year process. It was um, something that I wanted to make sure that was... A respected wine. I wanted to be wanted it to be something that could be paired with any meal mm -hmm. as well, mm -hmm. and also affordable. Yeah, mm -hmm. elegant well. and approachable, right? Yeah, that I like quiet that. luxury. Yes. Yes. Exactly. Mm -hmm. yes. So our, our slogan is "Sip on luxury." Sip <laughs> on luxury. So it's something that is is you know tastes really exquisite and full and expensive, but it's also not going to break the bank. You know what I mean? And I love that this came out about the same time you started doing the Wiz. Yes, <laughs> yes. I was totally focused. Uh, on developing and building the business. And then I got the call from uh, the production uh, to, to see if I wanted to workshop and, and be a part of the show. And I fell in love with the script. I fell in love with the cast. And here we are in Chicago, two weeks. Okay. Yeah. All right. Um, and you've done a few shows already. How, yes. how is the audience? How has it been with your time oh, here? Oh, my gosh. The audiences here are just exquisite. They just love the show. They, they are up on their feet. They're laughing crying they're all you know you you find grandmothers with their grandkids it's like multi-generational the yeah. audience you know mm. um and there's a lot of singing in this show <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay and we talked prior to the show today that there's been a lot of iterations of the whiz yes but you love the fact that this one's kind of going back to its roots yes yes it's um i think the essence of the show is broadway yeah. you know what i mean the version that we all know and love this show has the essence of that and carries the same uh, the music. We've also added a few extra songs Ooh. that um, people haven't heard um, as well. So it's it's a really special moment. It's, it'll be 50 years since it's um, been uh, on Broadway. Mm -hmm. So we'll be, we have a few more cities ahead of us, and then we head to Broadway in March. In Amazing. March. That Thank is you so exciting. So yes. Because I remember Glenda, <clears throat> excuse me, Mm -hmm. as appearing in the beginning mm -hmm. and in the end yes. of the show. Yes. Not so much throughout the middle. Right. What can, what can people expect to see from you when they come to the show? Well, I think the beauty about this, my Glinda, is that she sets Dorothy off on her journey. Mm -hmm. So there's an extra song that Glinda did not sing. Uh, and so there's a little shift in, I think, the storyline and what Glinda represents mm -hmm. to the whole story in its entirety. Okay. And you have to come to see the show. You have to okay. come to see the show. <laughs> okay, so what's next for you? Are there going to be more wines, more music? Yes, we yeah. want to build out the Kazaisu brand. We want to do um, more reds, Prosecco, and just, like, build it out and have a nice portfolio. 
Uh, but right now, it's the rosé. It's um, I love the bottle too, by the way. It is gorgeous. With the glass cork. Yes, it's yes. gorgeous. Sustainability. Yes. We wanted to make Super sure smart. that it was something that was um, not going to harm the environment. And you know, when you have children and you're thinking about the future and the world that we live in, you know, we want to make sure that we um, we preserve you know, our planet too. And people can feel comfortable in knowing that you are not a celebrity just slapped your name on a glass of right. wine. Right, yes. yes. You know, so many um, celebrities now just slap their name on a, on, on a spirit mm -hmm. or wine yeah. and not really involved with it. You no. have been there since day one. Yes, since day one. Uh, in fact, we just got certified uh, by WeBank, so I have my women-owned business certification. Cool. So um, people can support that as well. Um, we're certified organic as well, and I've been involved with every aspect of building this brand, um, and it's important to me. That's you know, good. it's important to me that the real sommeliers will, you know, give us a, a, a real, true rating that um, you know is comparable to any other, you know, wine and spirit. And, and your I, kid's name is on it too, yeah. so you got to make sure All to right. put it. Yeah, make sure you yes. check out uh, locations where you can purchase it. Um, yes. the website there. And on also, the Deborah says that there are a few sprinkling of tickets of the quiz available here Just in Chicago. Just a few sprinkles, Just a honey. Few. So I don't know if you can even get tickets. Okay. We got two shows today. And we still have uh, the rest of the week to go. So come and check out the, the Wiz. Oh, that's so exciting. The that is Cadillac so awesome. Theater. Thank All you right. for bringing it Thank here. Thank you for today. coming. Thank we you. appreciate it. We appreciate you so much.